Hello guys, today we are going to build an app that convert text to speech in Kotlin. I am Kairad Yaru, welcome you all in this tutorial. Thank you for subscribing to our channel and if you have not subscribed to our channel then subscribe our channel and give your valuable support. So let's begin. First create an android project. Make sure you have created a project in Kotlin. We will take a string from the user and then we will set up a button. So open activitymain.xml file and change the layout to linear layout. We will give the orientation to vertical. First, we have to set up edit text. So write edit text, give the width to match parent and height to wrap content. We will set id. So write android colon id equal to edit text. Now we will set the button. So write button set the width to match parent and height to wrap content. Now let's set the button text. So write text equal to speak and we will set up the id of button. So write android colon id equal to btn. So we have set up our design. Now open activitymain.get file first we will register the object of edit text and button. So write where btn colon button equal to find view by id. In this bracket we have to pass the id of button. So write r dot id dot btn. Now we will register the object of edit text. So write where edit text colon edit text equal to find view by id. In this bracket we have to pass the id of edit text. So write r dot id dot edit text. Now we will initialize the text to speech library. So write lit in space where text to speech colon text to speech. Now to initialize the text to speech library write text to speech equal to text to speech in this bracket first we have to pass the context so write this and then we have to pass the listener so write this as of now this will showing error because we have not implement the on init method so right click on it and implement the interface now in this method first we will check the initialization so write if status equal equal to text to speech dot success then first we will set the language so write well res equal to text to speech dot set language in this bracket we have to pass the language so write local dot us now sometimes language is not supported by the device so we have to check it so write if res equal equal to text to speech dot length underscore missing underscore data and end res equal equal to text to speech dot length underscore not underscore supported then we have to print that language is not supported so write toast dot make test in this bracket first we have to pass the context so write this then we have to write the message so write language not supported and then we have to pass the duration so write toast dot length long and at the end dot so now when text to speech library is not initialized then we have to print that initialization is fail so in the else part write toast dot make test in this bracket first we have to pass the context so write this and then we have to write the message so write fail to initialize and then pass the duration and at the end write dot so method so we have initialized our text to speech library now we have we will set up our click event so write btn dot set on click listener now when user click on button first we will get the string so write where ch colon string equal to edit text dot text dot to string so we have get our string now we have to write the speak function so write text to speech dot speak in this bracket first we have to pass the string so write ch then we have to pass the q so write text to speech dot q underscore plus and at last we have to pass the parameter so in our case it is null so we have set up our code now let's run our application and see the output so we can see our app is up running now we will give the string that thank you for subscribing to our channel and let's click on this button thank you for subscribing to our channel 
so we can see our app is running successfully thank you guys for watching this video do comment and don't forget to subscribe our channel